Now, I've debated doing this for a while now, but today I've just decided to go for it. In today's video, you're going to get to see my entire Rust wipe in one video. This is five days of Rust content jammed into one video. And of course, in true Jordan Rant style, I'm going to be living on my own island. Without further ado, may the Rust gods be with us. Let's get into it. Uh, somebody's shooting good over there. That doesn't sound good. Oh, and we got AK. AK over there. Let's avoid dying. Now, I noticed that there was two islands on this map. Straight away, my goal was to go over there and check them both out and see which island I wanted to build on. So I headed over there, made a quick pit stop at the bandit town, managed to win some scrap because I'm a lucky bugger when it comes to this wheel. Come on, lads. Yes. That's enough scrap for a tier one workbench. So I headed down to the bottom of the map to check out the two islands. Uh, which one shall I check out first? Let's go to the one on the right first. That's got two rivers, whereas the one on the left only has one. I don't think anyone lives on this island. The only problem with this island is how big it is. I like to take over islands that are smaller so I can take the whole thing over, but this is massive. After doing a little bit of farming, I chilled out by the campfire for the night and just waited for it to get to morning. Now, I pretty much decided that this island was not for me. There was nobody living on here except for remnants of a roleplayer base that had clearly been destroyed. So on that note, I just decided I'm going to go check out the other island. All right, it's a metal base on this island. Um, and there's some bigger bases over there. You can see them. So yeah, we got metal base right there. It's not decaying. Potentially a raid target. And uh, we also have big base over here. Like a big base. And, th and there's a decaying base to the left. See, there's way more going on on this island. And there's a w there's, there's loads of little bases on this island. This is way better than the other one. Uh, let's see if there's any loot in here. I don't think so. No. Oh, what? What? Turns out it was a flipping good idea that I decided to come over to this island. This has to be one of the luckiest decayed bases that I've ever come across, especially considering the fact that it's so early on in the wipe. Main thing right now is I need to secure this loot as quickly as possible, which means I need to build a base. 2,000 scrap? Okay, guys, don't, don't expose me on YouTube, but this is scripted. No, I'm joking. We have to get a base down. Satchel. Okay, I'm not going to check the chat for a sec. I need to build a base. Just for the record, but all of this was being live streamed on Twitch. So if you guys ever want to catch me playing Rust live, feel free to drop me a follow. Link's in the description. I don't want to build uh, too close to those guys. I'm building over here. We're going to have to get through the tool cupboard as well. Um, I've got a lot of the blueprints on this server, so it's not going to be too uh, difficult to get stuff done. All right. What the hell is happening here? Um, crafting a, a box and we're gonna store away this loot. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I gotta get a, an airlock down as soon as possible. I need metal. So let me go. Let me go and loot everything. Early bird gets the worm, mate. Is that the saying? Uh, I'm gonna loot everything and that before I destroy the TC. I don't want to. Uh, I'm gonna destroy the TC using the the satchel. But I'm just gonna prioritize all the good loot. We'll come back and get the rest. So I couldn't have asked for a better start here. I joined the server early in the morning, so the population was not peak yet, which meant that I was the first person to find this decayed base, luckily, because it does get hectic later on. I'm actually on a little bit of a time restraint in this part of the video because I'd agreed to meet with my grandfather to play some guitar. He's fully vaccinated now, and I wasn't expecting to get this lucky on Rust, so I've got two hours to build a secure base. Let's get it done. Okay, large box is being crafted. All right, let's go. Let's get through the TC. Blow up. All good. What we got? I will take it. There might be more loot on the on the other side that I haven't seen yet. Okay, we'll come back for the rest in a sec. Main thing right now is just getting this loot in my base. 1,000 gunpowder. Like, now now that we've had such a good start, I mean, I could just craft some satchels and just go and raid somebody else on the island. 
Okay, crafting another box to store away all this loot. <laughs> yeah, you've been streaming 50 minutes, have all that. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> right, this I haven't seen these yet. What we're looking at here, explode ammo. Uh, oh, wait, he does have my satchel skin. <laughs> That's cool. Right, I'm going to depot the MP5. Uh, if there's cloth here, I need to craft some sleeping bags. Yes, there is. We're going to go ahead and craft um, three of those. The more sleeping bags you get around the, your base, the better. So that's that's always a good shout. Um, chainsaw jackhammer can be stored away for now. Those are going to be useful for just upgrading the base and stuff like that. And uh, other than that, we're all good. Do these guys have a tier two workbench? I didn't actually get a chance to see. I mean, if you've got that much loot, surely you've got a tier two. Okay, well, if they've got a tier two, then I'm going to take it and craft garage doors. Yes, they do. And they have a shotgun trap and stuff like that. Okay, I'll take the shotgun trap. Nice. Grab that. We have the tier two. Grab the stone to upgrade the base and the metal. Place another sleeping bag down. Furnaces aren't really priority, obviously, but I just want to have them down in my base smelting while I am uh, doing this. I'm going to take that double barrel. Don't want to be double barreled in the face anytime soon. And the water pipe. Okay, we're heading back. Uh, let's start smelting metal right now. Um, garage doors and stuff like that will be crafted soon. Can we craft ladder hatches on this server? Yes, we can. Okay, uh, I'm going to place down some more furnaces, get some more metal smelting so that we can get some garage doors down. Let me rename this bag to base. Place that there for now. Grab more wood. Grab more metal. Get these furnaces whacked on. Metal is smelting. All right, let's craft a flamethrower. And let's go and raid. There's a wooden base across the river. Let's go and raid that real quick. See what's inside. And when we get back, we should be able to craft some garage doors. Okay, hello, Brit. Now, this wooden door that you see right here is my friend Brit's door. He's a fellow Rust YouTuber. I'm sure a lot of you know who he is. And I'm going to be one of the first people to flame raid it. So the door says I have nothing. Let's see if this guy actually has nothing. Let's do it. This is Brit's wooden door right here. Let's go. All right, there's just a tool cupboard inside there like I expected. Let's see what's in there. I'm not expecting much at all, but let's have a look. 400 wood, somebody's guessing. Place your guesses in the chat. Yeah, 400 wood sounds about right. One K wood, four hundred wood. I'll be happy if it's one K wood. I'll be happy with that. All right, we're in. If it, if there's a bag, then we know there's a lot of loot. If it's just the wood, then no. I think it's just the wood. All right, whoever guessed nothing was correct. There was absolutely zilch. Yo, Brit's wooden door is actually is actually right. <laughs> There's nothing. The words, I have nothing. I should have listened to the door, man. Two garage doors. What we want to do when we're upgrading a base like this is we want to make it as less obvious as possible that there's a lot of loot in here. So obviously having all this armored exposed on the ceiling, it makes it pretty obvious that I've probably got a lot of loot in here. So the first priority is covering that up with stone. And I'm also going to leave a little bit of the base made out of wood from the entrance just to put people off that little bit more. <laughs> added an exterior of stone and wood, you can no longer see the armored, which makes my base much less of a target, especially this early on in the wipe. Now, here's a massive coincidence. You remember how I just raided Brit's wooden door? Well, I was streaming on Twitch, as I've already mentioned. Brit decided to raid my stream. This means that after Brit ended his own stream, he sent all of his viewers over to my stream. So I had to tell him about the little raid I just did on his wooden door. Hello, Ty. Holy Brit. Brit! Hey, Brit, listen to me, bro. Brit, listen to me. I freaking raided a base that had your wooden door. And it said, obviously, I have nothing, right? And, like, I raided it and I was like, well, I need to prove this wrong because, you know, this guy, surely it's got something. Guess what? The base had absolutely nothing. There was, when I say nothing, there was nothing. So, your door skin is right, man. Thanks for the raid, mate. Appreciate it, dude. Hell yeah, man. Thanks a lot, Brit. Hope you have a good one, man. 
So after upgrading the base and uh, getting a kind raid from my friend Brit, it was time to go and do some recycling. So I headed over to the outpost. Lucky for me, the outpost is right next to the island that I've built on, which is actually really good. Living next to the outpost on Rust gives you a lot of benefits. You know, you can trade your stone in for wood, which is huge. You can obviously go and recycle stuff safely. So lots of benefits living next to outpost. Well, you're quite far... Whoa, 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 whoa. I just got free loot. What are you doing? You're recycling two at the same time. You're crazy. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. All right, it's time for me to recycle. We're going to be here for a while. All right there, mate. <laughs> Potentially a stream sniper, but whatever, he's naked. Now, whilst I was at the outpost buying a few things with the scrap I just got from recycling, my friend Blizzard showed up in my stream. I wish I had an emote here. Hey, Blizzard! I wish I had an emote here. <laughs> Blizzard, how you doing, man? Feel free to join me if you want, mate. Now, my friend Blizzard agreed to join me. And a lot of you probably know Blizzard. He's been in a lot of my videos. And he's a streamer. He's a Twitch streamer. He's pretty damn good at Rust. So having him on my team is pretty solid. Now, here's the deal. Although I'm about to play with Blizzard, Blizzard will not be living in my base. Because it turns out, by pure chance... Blizzard already has a base on this server. Blizzard and I have played similar servers together in the past, so we both have blueprints on similar servers. So the fact that he has a base on this server is no surprise. So I live here on this island. Blizzard's base is all the way on the other side of the map near Bandit Town. So this is the deal. Blizzard and I are going to be alliance. We're going to live in separate bases on separate parts of the map, but we're going to occasionally play together to do raids or to do cargo ship or oil rig or various other things that we can come together and do as a team. But we have agreed to live in separate bases. We've also made a little bit of a side bet on who can build the better base in this whole wipe. So both of us have got five days and whoever can build the better base is going to win the bet. So you'll find out who wins that at the end of today's video. Anyway, Blizzard's going to be joining me for a little bit. Remember, I've got to visit my granddad very soon to play guitar. So I've got a little bit of time left left to do a few raids on the island. Wait, which server is this then? Why do I have bags on here? Wait, do you do you have a sewer branch in the snow on G10? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Wait. I have a tiny base on here. I was playing on here like yesterday, but like after I quit the other server kind of deal. What the, what are the chances of that? Well, how big is it? Uh, I mean, just the one by three. It's uh, super basic. I basically did nothing. Uh, all right, guys. Blizzard's joining us. And obviously, he's going to stream as well. But I want to I want to do this raid with Blizzard. He already has a base on the server. So he can just stay in his base. He's not living with me. He can go and live in his own base. It'll be quite fun, actually, to live in separate bases, I think. All right, guys, it's, t it's time to start crafting anyway. So, I mean, I could pretty much craft a lot of things, can't I? Tier 2 workbench, that's what we need right now. Level, uh, sorry, Tier 3. Uh, so, we're going to need 100 high qual, 1,000 metal, and 1,000 scrap. The high qual might be an issue. There's 9 there. There's 27. And how much have we actually got in there? Uh, 46. And a little bit more. If we just smelt a little bit more, we should be fine. So, we'll just smelt a little bit more. There's like 60 in there, so that's fine. One garage door is down. And then we'll get the other garage door and we'll whack that down as well. Just gonna go get some trees, guys. It's me, it's me. <laughs> you absolute. All right, well, there's Blizzard spawned in the bag that I'd given him and tried to murder me with a rock. We're off to a good start. <laughs> Now that Blizzard was with me, it was time to go ahead and start raiding some of the bases on the island. I'm going to start with the metal 2x2 that I saw earlier on. And we're not going to be satchel raiding because we've just placed the tier 3 workbench down, which means that we can craft explosive rifle ammo. It's a bit cheaper than using satchels. So without further ado, let's begin exterminating the bases on the island so we can take this over for ourselves. This is it. This is what I'm thinking about. It could have nothing, but let's let's give it a go, eh? Do you want to be my cover or do you want to help me shoot? I'll just cover her. Or, or actually, well, if we're out here on the island, it might be... It might be quicker, eh? All right, take yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. It's open. It's open. It's empty. Oh, my God. Just one CC. One door. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's probably an old raid base or something. Oh my god. <laughs> what a raid. Alright, follow me. We're going to do the next one over here. Alright. 
What a raid, boys. It's worth checking inside. I'm glad we didn't waste more, though. I'm really glad we didn't waste more. You <laughs> yeah. know what I mean? Like, I'd rather <laughs> it just be one door than, than anything else. Yeah, yeah. Wasting one door is okay. The next base on the island was another small one. Hopefully, we get more luck this time. bottom box i mean it's not a profit but uh the extra guns is good for sure you I mean, might it's yeah right. it's a good raid that's more than i expected honestly yeah that's yeah, not bad all right uh just grab and, and let's dip i'm good i'm good are you good yeah i can't take any more all right mate well i've got to go and uh, visit my grandfather and stuff so uh yeah you can head back to your base now keep the gear set do you need any food i can give you some food and stuff if you want i, I have enough all right all right mate See you later. See ya. I'll come visit your base next time. All right. All right, guys. We're out of the call with Blizzard. 1,800. Um, stone. So I logged off for a little bit here and went to play guitar with my granddad. Here's a little clip from that. My granddad is freaking awesome at playing the guitar. Just a heads up. guys want to watch more of my granddad playing some guitar i'll leave his youtube channel down below he occasionally posts blues music and stuff like that and um, so yes all right let's get back into rust okay i'm back in the game and uh blizzard is still in the team so he's still rocking around uh he's got his own base as i said before so he lives over there and i live over here all right blizzard's just mentioned that there's a base right next to where he lives and he wants to raid it but he can't craft any of the higher tier blueprints that i can craft so i'm gonna take a bunch of explosive ammo and some satchels and i'm gonna craft a bit more as well and i'm gonna help him raid his neighbor so let's go check out where blizzard lives and take a couple explosives with us as well to raid his neighbor this is your base is it this is your rock base basically this is sick this is sick, man. The fact that you're able to fit your base on this rock is Yeah, mental. I know, I know. That, that was cool. <laughs> I, I won't be able to do the multi-TC variation, obviously, but... So, as you can see, this is the start of Blizzard's base. And he builds some crazy base designs. And as you can see, he's built on a rock. So, he's got this whole rock area to himself. And it's pretty cool. Anyway, let's see what Blizzard's neighbor's got inside his base. This is the base. Looks promising. He's got a metal roof. YOLO. Oh, I, I'm... What the... I just got M2 lasered from a distance. LR, actually. Respawn, I have no, no idea. Where. Me neither, but I... I, I got I, absolutely destroyed. I, I, I think I know where it is. Uh, I think it's that base uh, up on the hill northwest. My game's just disconnected or something. Are you still online? Are you still online? Yeah, yeah. Oh, f I, sorry, I'm hidden. I'm hidden, but... I mean, if you're DC, you just... They're both looting my body right now. I killed them both. I killed them both. I have no HP though. You need to come back. Can only go as fast as my computer will let me, mate. All right, I'm in the game. You fine? Yeah, yeah. While I was disconnected, as you just heard, Blizzard respawned back in his base and managed to kill both of these guys that just came to counter. But these guys are not giving up anytime soon. Either way, Blizzard and I are going to continue on with the raid. Oh, it's an armored door, mate. In that case, we may as well go through the back of the base, I guess. I don't know. Wait, I hear somebody up on the hill. Kill them. Uh... Should we, should we, should yeah, we, I mean, how we... much do we have? How much expo ammo do you have? Do we even have enough uh, for that? 53. Yeah, we do. Yeah, that's not even nearly enough. No, but I have three satchels as well. Uh, I have 70 expo ammo still. So we've got enough then to get through this okay. one armored door. That's it though. Well, then we should go through the back though. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, like we should smash damage this or okay. something. Okay. Over here. Oh. Up on the roof. Hit him once.
Nice, you him. killed him. You killed one. There might be one more, remember? Yeah, yeah he is yeah. He's on the left. I saw him. Uh, 170. I'm pushing. Pushing with you. 200. Headshot him. Keep pushing, I guess. I shot him once. He might be dead. No, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Okay, you loot him and I'll find this guy's gun. Okay, I I'm gonna depot as well. Yep, sounds good. Go more towards the left than to the right. Okay, we're in. TC is on the left, on the right. I predicted a wall. Oh, it was pretty left. loaded. I know, I know. Up on the hill. I put him once. Blizzard and I had to get this loot secured as quickly as possible. We didn't have tool cupboards, so we couldn't patch up the base. But because Blizzard lives right next to the raid target, we were able to transport this loot to his base. We're not done with the raid yet, though. We need to get to tool cupboard. After we depoted the loot, Blizzard gave me all of the gunpowder and sulfur that he had in his base that had been smelting this whole time. And we went to the base that we were raiding because there was a tier 3 workbench inside the base. Unfortunately, Blizzard didn't have a tier 3 workbench yet. So we needed to use this tier 3 workbench to craft more explosive ammo. My base was too far away and we couldn't be bothered going there. So it's a bit budget, but we're doing it. Hell yeah, brother. Let's finish this raid and see what's inside the TC. Haven't spoke to you in a minute. Uh, how's bro? How's life? It's good, Flex. It feels good to be streaming again. It's been a whole month since I streamed last time, so... It's good to be back on the stream. One is lit. One is lit. I killed one, I killed one. The two guys that countered us just a minute ago have come back. And it's really important that I don't die here because of the amount of sulfur I've got on me at this moment in time. Did you kill him? Oh, sorry. Oh. No, one more. Ah, sh oh, you're dead. But of course I did die knowing me. <laughs> As per usual, it's all on Blizzard. He has to kill this one remaining guy. Otherwise, we're going to lose the raid. Kill them. Double headshot. Yeah, I think that's it. They have satchels on them. They have satchels on them to finish. They, they have satchels on them. Yeah. Let's depot this in your base before we do anything. Uh, the I mean, is it a lot? Yeah, it is. Okay. It's a decent amount. It's not something I'd want to lose. It's like 600 gunpowder and, and 1,200 scrap and stuff. Okay. Let's get that's it in. That's them. That's them. Close it off. Thank you, counter raiders. You brought the satchels to us. These guys were planning on finishing the raid for themselves. So they crafted satchels, but we were able to kill them and take them from them. So yeah, we'll kindly take the raid for ourselves. Thank you very much. Sorry, uh, getting shot from um, east. I'm so bad. Oh. Okay, uh, we're in TC right now. How's the loot? Pretty good, pretty good. A lot of hike. Oh, a lot of scrap, which is really good for me. How much scrap? Uh, 1,100. Uh, yeah. Just have a look around. I'm quickly going to grab the tier 3 because I really need that. Oh, 33 explore mo. Like, I mean, just, just random kind of stuff. There's an extra tier 2 in here. Five bodies. There's two extra tier 2s in here. Okay, I'm full. Let's go. I'm full. Yo, we're going to have to be dished. We're going to have to split this a little bit, Blizz. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I've actually provided more to this raid than you, interestingly enough. However... You 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 saved the raid like we would have just failed <laughs> if it wasn't for your skill. <laughs> so you're paying me as a mercenary. I'm pay I'm paying you as a mercenary exactly. <laughs> I, I would like to take some of the more role player stuff though, like the large battery, so I can electrify my base and all that sort of okay, stuff. Okay, I want the scrap though, because you don't have any use for scrap. What do uh, you want? I, I only really care about scrap and metal frags to upgrade my base and stone, I guess, or anything uh, else. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll figure it out. Somebody wants me to take your supply signal. That's fine. You can take it. Take the supply signal. We're good to go. And let me know if you need me to craft you anything at all, because I can craft pretty much everything. I'm fine for now. I'm ready to get back to my base and just go on a farming spree and upgrade my base, man. Same as you.
So after a successful raid, I took my share of the profits and Blizzard took his share and I headed back to my island. Blizzard decided to join me on the journey to the outpost, which is really close to my island. I stopped over there and did some recycling just to get a bit more scrap. As you can see in my inventory, I took a decent chunk of the sulfur from the raid because I'm the one that can craft explosives and Blizzard took all the scrap. Anyway, I got back to base, did a little bit of base upgrading. We're good. Base upgrading time. And that concludes day number one. I logged out pretty confident that my base would survive the night. Bring on day number two. Now I woke up relatively early, ready to start day number two. The first thing I wanted to do was some farming. Because it's early in the morning, the off-peak hours on a Rust server are always a good opportunity to get some farming done. So I grabbed the jackhammer, headed over to mainland into the snow, and farmed as many nodes as possible. Blizzard was already online at this point, as you can see in the bottom left-hand side of the screen. Today, I did actually want to play more solo and less with Blizzard, just to get more stuff done on my island. However, we do spend a little bit of time together at the beginning of today, as you're about to see. What did I just do to this guy? For real? I just destroyed this kid. Oh my god. This guy's got 48 tech trash. Let's go say hello to Blizzard with my new helicopter. I'm not sure if I killed. There was only one guy, right? Loads of fuel. He's in the airfield taking a crate right now. Let's go, boys. Hello, my friend. Let's How are you? Let's go to my base. Yeah, and yeah. then let's do cargo. Let's do cargo. You want to do car shot You want to do cargo? Yeah. yeah you want yeah. me to destroy my helicopter? No, no. Just drop me off. All right. I will do. Wait, wait, wait but first, go to my base. Go here. That's what I'm doing. Ba -da -ba -baum, ba -da -baum -baum. I just killed a guy and took his heli, mate. He was flying. And I triple headshot him. <laughs> nice. I have a full inventory of stone right now, so like, can you hurry your ass up, mate? <laughs> yeah, probably depot your stone first. Just in okay. case there's people there and they shoot you. But there's two people ahead of us as well. They look full geared, but yeah, you yeah. can probably take off and fuck off before. Alright, mate, let's get out of here. Sire. After depositing all my farm and of course the tech trash that I got from the guy I killed, Blizzard suggested that I drop him off at cargo. Now the original plan was to just drop him off and let him do cargo on his own, but things don't quite go to plan. This wall is insane, mate. Yeah, I've seen it. Where do you want me to drop you off? Uh, depends on, well, whatever you feel more comfortable. I can drop you anywhere, just what's the best be place? Uh, like towards the center, I guess, or like the front. But it depends on if there's people on here or not, really. Yeah, check for scientists. I'm not seeing them at the m moment. Uh, no. Look, oh, oh, there is, but yeah, there's people on there. He's on, he's at the back. He's at, the, he? there at he the back is. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, land me in the front. Wait, I'm low, mate. We're gonna have to retreat a sec. Yeah, 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 retreat and heal up. And then we can approach it from the front. And a bit, like, nose dive, and I'll just... I'll no, no, I, 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 I'll, I'll screw the heli. I'll buy another one later. I'll, I'll join you. All right, mate. Okay, you drive, then. Okay, okay, we should land in the front, then. You Wait, then I need to drive, yeah. Let's go. Really? People who get guns at a freaking lighthouse? Wait, do you want to join Discord if we're doing this? Yeah, sure. Join this. Call me on Discord. This is an awful idea, otherwise. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. You can hear me, right? Yeah, yeah. 
So we're just crash, crash landing this up here. Go, 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 go. Just absolutely ball yeah, it, yeah. mate. Jump. I did. I'm dead. Oh, you got glitched out. Yeah, I know, I know. It's You jumped a bit too late, but it's it's fine. Wait, I took way more damage than I thought I did. I didn't jump early enough, and I died. Now, we're going to switch to Blizzard's perspective. He was streaming at the time, so you'll get to see exactly what happens from his perspective here. He's on his own. We know there's at least two people on the cargo ship. Let's see if Blizzard can pull this off. In the meantime, I spawned back in my base, grabbed some scrap, and bought a boat from the fishing village. So I'm on my way to help him. But it's going to take me a while to get there. So he's on his own for now. One still in the back of the boat. Okay, I'm in my favorite hiding spot. <sighs> I killed one of them. I hear a motorboat. Killed another with a bow coming in. But his friend might have already come on. Like he turned off the engine to try and jump onto the boat. But it was like a different group. So there's still one, at least one guy on the boat on top. The guy that you was just killed multiple. I killed two, yes. Okay, I'm at the fishing village almost. I think he's right up here. Actually, he's probably camping all the way at top. Hmm. Killed him. Dead. Okay, just be careful. Yeah. Could be more. Yeah, there could be a guy that came on the boat. Yeah, I have the I have the back completely cleared though. But yeah, there could be a guy sneaking around get, down below. Are you getting all the loot? Yeah, like 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 oh, wow. they didn't manage to, they didn't manage to get anything. No, yeah, yeah. I got everything. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, they're loaded. Wait. From the front there's side. a duo. I just killed two people in the back here. I'm gonna mark them. Alright, you can't see the mark. It's a T3. Go there before you go there to the thing. There'll be a oh boat circling them. Oh my god, you're a beast. Bro, they got actually lasered. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I missed right? a single shot. Yeah, I shot 10 bullets and I killed two of them. <laughs> oh my god, you're an absolute beast! Okay, now we gotta rely on my amazing eyesight. You should see a boat circling in the area. It's it's two hazies. It's two hazies. A few moments later. I see them, I see them, yes. But I, I didn't see them. There's no way I would have seen that. I've only seen them because they just switched to body bags. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't see that so Normally it's easier. Yeah, no, see I see the body bags. The form. That must be a weird book then. Now let's see the body bags. Let's see what they had. Yeah, just basic stuff. Yeah, yeah. I mean, there were hazy bodies. And I was expecting you to be able to loot them faster. So it would have hopefully you have enough fuel to get here. I have should loads be fine. of fuel. Oh, yeah, because you can also grab fuel off of the other boat, right? Yeah, I have 200 fuel. Jordan's LR on this body as well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's a body all the way at the back that has a bunch of loot on it. I can show you if you come back here. After stealing cargo from these boys, Blizzard did all the work, let's be honest. Um, it was time to get out of here. The last crate unlocked at the very last minute, just as the siren went off. We gotta go! And Blizzard and I got out of here. We decided to go back to my island first. Let's go to your base. Who's what going? He had 48 tech trash? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't mention that, dude. That's so much scrap right there. I mean, how much is, is it? Is it 50 per, right? Oh, 20 per. 20 per? Bro, that's nine. That's a thousand uh, and scrap. And I think five high qual. That's a thousand scrap. Obviously, I'm not going to recycle all of it because... All right, I'm going to leave the call. Good cargo, mate. Okay. All right, guys. Blizzard has gone. Uh, we just did cargo together. So the rest of today, I'm um, mostly going to play solo. Kind of find some raid targets. And yeah. All right, let's upgrade the space a little bit first. <laughs> After doing some base upgrading, the base was looking pretty beasty. Now it's time to do a solo raid. We've not done a proper solo raid yet because we've been doing a lot of duo with Blizzard, but it's time to go on my way 
and do a little solo raid. And the first place I'm going to look for bases to raid is the island next to my island. Remember, there's two islands. I'm going to go and check out the other island and see if there's any new bases that have appeared on there that might be worthy of raid targets. Now, I've been over to this island a few times while farming, and I did see a few rock bases. So we might potentially raid a rock base here. But let's go check it out. So here we are. We've arrived on the other island. And this island has a few, as I said, rock bases that are, look quite interesting. So uh, let's check them out. I think they're both solo players. Okay, this guy's online. Uh, he's he's That's fresh twig that I've seen. Part of me wants to try and, like, be friendly with this guy. He, I don't know. Like, I like it. I like your rock base, mate. But, yeah, this guy started upgrading, guys. This guy has began to upgrade his base. So this is one of the raid targets. And then another raid target is over this way. Now, this guy's got honeycombing and all that good stuff. So it might be a little bit trickier to raid him. But then there's another base over here that might be easier. So let's check this one out. Uh, it's round here somewhere. Wait, where is it? Here it is. So you got this base as well. And this one has a code lock on it. I'm definitely a little bit worried about that guy living over there. He might come and counter. I'm not sure what sort of guns he has. Um, but this base looks kind of easy. Let right, well, he's asleep inside and he's got burlap. Uh, with this type of base, I'd probably just go through the doors. All right, and this is the raid target then. We're going to go through the doors. Um, it's just a guy with burlap. It's a small base, but we'll start the day off by raiding this guy. It's a nice rock. It looks pretty cool. As you see, it goes into the rock there at the back. Um, all right, let's go back to base and let's grab some Explamo. And that, that'll be the first guy we raid then. Okay, we have a door, a lock, a TC, check. We have loads of meds, check. We have five rifles. We shouldn't need to repair these in a work, in a repair bench. So I'm just going to hope that we'll be fine. Now let's uh, get rid of all the ammo in there because we're going to be using explore ammo. Door, lock, TC, check. Building plan, hammer. All the rifles right here. We're ready to go. It's about to get to night. I might just do it at night. We'll see. We're going to go through the doors and begin. Let's start our explore ammo raid, everybody. Okay, we got another door, which is kind of why I expected. We're, we're still going to go through the doors, I think. Here's the player that lives here. It's doors all the way around, man. It's going to be another door after that, isn't it? Okay, we're going to continue doors. Another door. Okay, there's sulfur there. That That's nice. Okay, we're going back to base to craft more explore ammo. Okay, obviously, we're going to repair all the, the weapons in a sec. No, the silences are pretty low as well, so we'll repair those as well. Okay, gunpowder. All right, we're good to go, guys. We're good to go. Where's the guy with the double barrel just waiting at the base? Where you at, mate? Show yourself. There you are. How you doing? You got a rifle? Not bad. Got any friends around here? Are you from that base, maybe? Here you are. Hey, mate. We can be friendly about this, dude. Just leave me be. Let me do my thing. How so? Well, well, just let me do my thing, and then we'll be cool. And what's your thing? I'm raiding your neighbor. I'm raiding the, the guy living next to you, on the rock next to you. Okay, I'm not gonna bother you then. All right, sweet, man. Well, I live on the other island. Do you want to be friends? We can, like, make a little alliance, just like, yeah. I live on the other island, the one next to you. I have a big metal base. Um, I'm naked. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, sure. I mean, if you come on this island, I'm gonna shoot at you, but otherwise, oh, yeah, that's I'm fine. not gonna that's go fine. raid you. That's fine. All right, take your rifle back. Don't shoot me with it. This is Dominic. Well, his name is not actually Dominic. That's just what his name appears to me because I've got streamer mode on. To me, this is Dominic. And you're going to be seeing a little bit more of this guy today. It's my first proper alliance that I've made outside of Blizzard. And Blizzard doesn't really count because he's my friend anyway. Anyway, making alliances on Rust is a freaking awesome thing. So Dominic seems like a trustworthy guy. We're officially allianced. Later on, I invite him to the team and stuff like that. And you'll see more of Dominic. But this is my first alliance. Say hello to Dominic. Go in your base. All right, That's good. Not gonna. All right, mate. Oh, one more thing. One more thing. What's up? There's a two by two behind those rounds over there. It's empty. It used to be my base. Ah, all right. All right. Thanks for letting me know, man. Take it easy. Let's do this. We're in. 
in. We're at TC. It's unlocked. Locks down. Doors on. Raid complete. Let's do it. Nice. C4. Loads of components. Actually decent. I will take it, mate. He's doing all right. Whack a lock on that. I'll take the C4. Uh, he must have got that from an airdrop. I'll take the extra guns and that sort of stuff. And yeah, the ninja suit looks awesome. Oh my god. I need to watch Abe and get that on three of my Steam accounts at the least. To your raid fund. Thanks, Fred. Okay, let's get back to base. Deposit this loot and then get the rest of the loot in a minute. All right, we made it back with the first lot and the most important lot of loot. 128 high qual. That is freaking decent. All right, we're back. I'm going to go ahead and grab the two furnaces. Sorry for raiding you guys. It is what it is. Uh, I'll take the extra, like, tier ones and stuff. Eventually, I'll set up a shop and I'll be selling workbenches and stuff like that. So, yeah. Okay, that rifle sounds like it's coming from the guy's base who I'm allied with now. So, I'm not going to go for that. Oh, my God. I didn't see that 800 gunpowder. What the hell? How did I miss that? There was 800 gunpowder in here. Okay, we're good here for now. And the rest of the loot is crap to me, but I might come back and grab that later. But it is mostly crap. Somebody shut down the heli. Oh, right, let's get back to base. And then that will be a successful raid for us. We made it back. Sweet. I'm actually going to start electrifying the base now. I've got some really cool plans with electricity. So I'll show you guys that soon. But yeah, let's add solar panels on top of the base and add the batteries and all that stuff. Hello, my friend. Hello. I, I'm allianced with another dude that lives on uh, like on the other side of the map. So I'm already in alliance and we have a team. And what, if you want, you can join the team. Sure. Yeah, sweet. And then if you need anything or Make what- this easier. Yeah, exactly. Sweet. All right. Nice one. Okay. See ya. See ya, mate. Now it's a proper alliance. <laughs> Have lift off. Both doors open. Now let's get the turret going. Awesome. Turret's on. Good stuff. Ceiling. Okay. All right. Good luck door camping me now. For those of you wondering what I've done here, um, I've added a door controller to both the garage doors that I've just placed outside my base that are linked to a switch at the front of my base. And when I press the switch, it opens the doors and behind the doors is an auto turret. So it's essentially a defense against door campers. It's pretty cool. I like to do this whenever I get electricity up in my base and I've got an auto turret to spare. Anyway, we just raided a base on the other island, but I've not really had chance to check out what's been going on on my island, to be honest. And turns out there's a few new bases that have appeared, kind of like a village of players that are all teamed up together. They all have separate bases, but they're all kind of allied. So obviously I don't know who these guys are. I've made the decision. I want to raid them. I'm not going to try an alliance with them or anything. They're on my island and uh, I've decided I want to raid them. Look at that player. Get a gun. Okay, so there's these players right here, they live on my island and there's a few of them. That guy has a gun. He's online right now. We just saw him. But it's really annoying because, like, they're upgrading their base and I kind of want to get rid of them. So I might quickly get rid of this guy. I might do an online raid right now. We just saw that he had a gun. He is a solo player like me. And they're on the other side of my island. And they've not caused me a lot of problems, but they're on my island and fair is fair. If I do an online raid, it could be pretty cool. Okay, uh, explosive ammo. Let's go. Craft a bunch of that. I have enough explorer mode to get through a couple of doors. If this guy wins this raid, then fair play. But it's an online raid. And I'm just going to go for it. Imagine if I just got killed right now. I mean, it wouldn't surprise me. These guys are all allied together. This guy's trying to hit through something. Okay, well, these guys are all together. I suggest we just go for it. Okay, let's keep getting through this. Keep going in. It's a really weird base design. I think I've only got enough to get through one more door. I'd have to eco-raid the rest of the base. Oh, I should have brought my jackhammer. I can just eco-raid the rest. Hmm, I don't know. Why didn't I bring my jackhammer with me, man? Oh 
Almost killed him. I need my neighbor to reply. Sweet. Bring seven pickaxes, mate. Okay, my, my new my new neighbor. My new my ally from the other island is coming over to help me. So these guys are all teamed up. But I'm also teamed up with the freaking guy on the other island, so. Killed that guy. Got his Thompson. See, that guy's from the other base over there. We're kind of all together around here. My na my my other island neighbor should be coming over in a sec with the six pickaxes so I can eco raid. I'm getting shot by a guy with a bow now. Thank God I brought loads of freaking uh, bullets with me for my Thompson. Okay, okay, that guy just placed the door down. I just got, I just got outplayed. I just got outplayed. I just, oh, it doesn't matter, mate. I screwed it up at the last minute. Place. He placed the, he placed the door down. Uh, God damn it! Well, thank you for coming over, so man. Do you need surf phone? I can give you. I, I nah. can give you some surf phone if you want to continue. I, ha I, I have, I have sulfur. Um, I definitely. Oh, I can't believe it. I just got outplayed, man. All right. Um, don't worry. I'll, I'll, I'll smelt up more sulfur. I'm definitely gonna raid this guy. Uh, it's all good, man. Thank you for coming do, over. Do you actually have some rat suits? I, I was fresh out. Yeah, I didn't have rat suits, so I didn't come with a gun. I didn't want to have a gun and be naked. Oh, you mean? Oh, right. No, you mean to help me with the raid? Um, well, I'm gonna have to smelt upon my sulfur. Yeah, yeah. And then what we're gonna do is I'm gonna bring a jackhammer and then we're gonna eco raid up the base because it's it's all stone. But yeah, I need to craft a bit more explamo. Oh, so uh, I'm I'm raiding every single one of these guys. All right, take the hazzy. Um, this guy's gonna be poor, but it's it's the principle, man. Okay, I'm going back now. Let's go. Hey, mate. Uh, let's do this, mate. Through this one. Okay, where's his TC? That's the question. It must be in a different part of the base. Uh, oh, no. I think it's behind oh, this it, wall. oh, no, it's destroyed. We destroyed it. It was there. Look, down there, mate. Right down there. Uh, do you need stone? Oh, yeah. I'll take Fair the stone. Enough. Yeah, let's see what loot they had. He had. You don't need that. Oh, well, whatever you need, feel free to take no, it. I don't need it. Come and have a look. What's the, what's in the loot? Ooh, not bad on this box. Not not too bad. You need metal or yeah, anything? Not bad. I'm gonna take the red suit. Yeah, definitely not like amazing, but I'm glad I at least won this in the end. You know, nice. I must say, mate, you are the be a very amazing neighbor, and uh, I would like to just say thank you. Thank you. <laughs> for help, for um, helping me today, my mate. Yeah, it's fine. Um, you sure you don't want anything, mate? Like, do you want MP5? Anything like that? Yeah, take the wood. Whatever you need. I mean, I want to take the MP5, yeah. All right, MP5's in the it. box right there. So probably they didn't try to use it. Oh, it's out of ammo. Yeah. Oh, I... uh, have your pistol bullets. I took them off of you. All right, I'm going to put a TC down and stop them from um, building back here. There we go. And then uh, one more thing before I leave. Uh, take anything else that's in there, mate. Charcoal, anything you've got room for, take it. All right, awesome stuff. Um, thank you for helping me, mate. If you need help with any raids on your island, let me know. I'll be right there. Okay, I will. And if you need any BPs or anything like that, just write in the team chat. And that concludes day number two. We managed to do some raids. We did some base upgrading. Overall, I would say it was a pretty successful day. Let's get on for day number three. <laughs> Hope you guys are enjoying this, man. It's a long video. I'll tell you, editing this right now, it's, I've been taking, it's took me a while. Let me know down below, guys, if you're enjoying the longer video format. All right, let's get into day three. I'm starting today off 
by building a very much needed furnace base. I'm sick of using small furnaces. I've got more than enough charcoal. We need a large furnace and an oil refinery. Let's build a furnace base. Right then, let's whack this large furnace on. We now have a furnace base. Okay, I'm gonna start today off by doing a quick trip to the outpost. Oh my God. I can't go into the um, I can't go into the outpost for 20 seconds or something. 10 seconds and I can get into the outpost. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm going to the safe zone. I just came to the outpost to recycle and I wanted to do that in peace. And then this guy freaking is at the right place at the right time with his P250. I made it though. <laughs> I finished cycling and I've got 480 scrap out of it and 60 high quality. I think the guy that shot me with the P2 lives in that new base over there. That small little two by one. It, I've, I don't recognize that. He lives in this base. Now he's going away on his boat. Here's his body right here. Do we quickly raid him just for fun? Yeah, let's do it. I might just craft 10 satchels to do this raid. All right, I'm going for it. Hopefully we get good explosions here. Get us in the base, please. One more. Come on, just blow up. Blow up. Player coming over with a double barrel. I see him down there. CC's unlocked, which is good. But this double barrel guy, I've got to be careful of him. All right, let's grab the loot and go. Fastest raid ever, this. Someone's got a P2 over there. Okay. I didn't really need to build in because I don't know what sort of loot's in here. There's not a lot in here. I see a player over there. Heck, double headshot him. He has to be dead. There's also a helicopter that just landed right there. Let's store away this loot and see if we can go and get a kill here. Now, as you can see, I got absolutely wrecked by the outpost here. <laughs> I lost a gear set. Luckily, though, I still kept some of the loot from the raid, but there wasn't a lot in this raid anyway. So, unfortunately, we started the day off by dying, but the day is not over yet. I respawned and grabbed myself a gun and headed back to where I died to see if I could grab my loot. Somebody in this base with a hammer. I did notice this new base that had been built, and it had a player inside, and he was trying to break something. I don't know what he was doing. So, I grabbed all the loot from the base that I raided and transported it back to my island base and while I was there I crafted some ladders to see if I could ladder up on top of this base and see if there was any way to get inside okay we're gonna have to ladder up quickly and just see what the hell this guy's doing okay no it is the base owner because there's a ladder hatch right there I had no idea what this guy was doing at this point and I didn't think much of it in fact I just waited for a few minutes to see if he opened this ladder hatch so that maybe I could go deep but he didn't open the ladder hatch, and I'm pretty sure he heard me place the ladder so he knew I was outside waiting. So anyway, I left this guy to do his thing. But keep note of this base, remember it, because we're going to be coming back to this later. Hello. Uh, yo. How are you doing today, Good mate? Morning. Now, after having a conversation with my new allied neighbor, I headed back to my island. And while I was on my way there, I remembered one thing. We've still got bases to raid on here. And one of them is this base right here that you see on the screen. Now, remember how I said that these group of bases are all kind of allianced? Well, this base that you see is sitting in the middle of all of the bases that are like allianced. Now, I raided one of them yesterday. But today, I'm going to go for the guy in the middle because I think he's probably going to have the most loot. I'm going to be joined by an extra friend. I'm letting my friend Elle build on my island. She's a Rust streamer. Check her out. She's going to build a cottage. Add a nice little bit of role player into this island. Why not? All right, I'm logging back in the game. My friend Elle is ready to join me. Oh, g'day, g'day. How you doing? Mate, I'm ready. I have my own island, mate. Really? Yeah, my very own island. All right, hello, hello. Hello, oh, you're, hello, you've hello. got the um, you got the mummified thing on you. How does that work? I do. 
Oh, it was a skin. It's no like, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, I just can put mummy wraps on. It's sick. All right, well, let me give you a base tour. Come on, it's safe. It's safe. Safe. This now. is where I live. This is my island. Um, and yeah, it's it's a it's a good island to live on. Now, after giving L a little bit of a base tour, Dom decided to show up. Hello there. Hey yo. This is my. All right, this is my my friend. Uh, she is a part of the alliance now. Uh -oh. She's gonna build a wood base. Oh, okay. Yep. Oh, so that's nice. Cottage, you're Where are you guys headed? Uh, we we're just gonna we're just gonna do a raid soon. I'm I'm planning on doing cargo right now. Oh. Okay. Ooh. Fancy. Oh hell yeah, dude. Um, should we help him or should we just leave him? It's up to you. We can help him if you want. Should we what? Oh, well, I'm oh, sorry. I just I was asking, should we help you uh, to my teammate in Discord? Uh, do you want help? We can help you. I mean, if you want. Yeah, no, no, yeah, that's cool. We'll help you. It's up to you. Sure. Uh, there's a bone right over there, that way. All right. Well, it looks like we're doing cargo before we do the raid, everybody. Yes. We're gonna go see if we can do this with Dom. Let's get it. Wow, he really does sound really tired. I'm gonna ask him when was the last time he slept. Oh, <laughs> go on. My goblins. Goblins. Yeah. When, when was the last time you like slept? Do you do you like just constantly play Rust and never sleep? Or... No, I slept the night. Oh, good, good. As long as long as you're getting a good rest, mate. As long as you're getting a good oh rest. Oh my god! I sleep like a normal person. Yeah, you, you've offended oh, him. Glad. So we headed over to Cargo, and we quickly realized that there was actually people on here. Watch out, there might be people on here. Hill. Three crates, guys. Drive to the side. Get us on. There's people on here. Okay. Oh, oh God. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, <laughs> I went to the boat. <laughs> um, um, Where's the boat? <laughs> Dom, have, Where's you the ever, boat? have you ever done cargo before, Dom? <laughs> I have. Huh? Oh, Where's yeah. the fucking Wait, boat, though? <laughs> Oh my... Where's the boat? We're stranded! Fucking <laughs> boat! Oh my god. You should god. be right here. I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> well, that was great. That was good cargo. Hey, good loot. Good loot. Oh, I good found loot. it, boys! Oh, I found it! It's here! It's here! It's here. Oh. It's yes! Here. I only have one low grade. We're out of low grade. We're out of low grade. Oh, switch, switch. I have low grade. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. L, L, L. Oh, oh, oh. Go, 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 go. Huh? All the scientists are here, which is a slight issue, but yes. Yeah. He's at the back, mate, definitely. He's there. Got him. Nice, Got nice, 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 nice. Uh, oh, Dom died. It's just us. Oh, he's got heavy metal. I just, just take some meds. Do you want to wear it or? Uh, you, you, you take it, you take it. I'll grab Dom's star. I've got his kit. Do you want to take his MP5? Yeah, I'm just pretty bad with the MP5. All right, I'll just, I'll, you just can't. I already have an MP5, so you take his. Heli. Okay. Oh my God. Oh, there it is. Oh, I lit him up. I lit him up. He's got incense bullets. He's landed on the top. Yeah, screw this. I'm getting off the boat. I'm getting off the boat. Yeah, just get off. Sweet. Well, I, I got off with a bunch of loot. Shoot, is there one more? There's... We, we killed... We, yeah, we killed... The, there's only go? one. There's only one. I don't know if you want to go back. Do you want to go back? He's got an AK. I mean, we could, we could pick up the other... Uh, no, yeah. Uh, we're we're going to come... And, L, we're going to come pick you up. Yeah, let's go pick her up. I have a hazmat ready for you and stuff. Yeah, go, 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 go. You drive. Okay. Hey, I'll take this. Uh, I'm going to have to give you an MP5, even though I know you said you're not good with it. Uh, I don't know if that's going to be useful wearing that, but yeah. Let's go. Oh, no. Oh, it's only you. Oh, sorry. Are you dead? I'm dead. All right, Dom, let's give this one more go. Me and you, mate. What do you want to do? I want to go for it. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Shot them twice. Oh, they got me. Oh, damn it. So, that's such a good weapon, man. 
There's a man on your island. Oh, there is? Uh, Cindy. Are they speaking to you? Yeah, it's a female. Okay. She, she lives north on the island. Oh, really? She could have killed me. Uh, definitely didn't. What weapon have they got? A bow, but I'm just naked, so... Oh, and they didn't kill you. I'll, I'll keep that in mind, yeah. then. Letting yeah. my friends stay alive. Nice. Allowing me to farm wood as well. Yep. How kind. How kind of them. Oh, that's really cool. Actually, I kind of want to meet meet them. I'll try and find them and, and get them to come over. Are you bringing her over to my base to meet the owner of the island? <laughs> I am. I am. I am. Hello there. Hello. Hi. Yes, uh, I heard that you live on my island. Yeah. I hope that's okay. You gotta throw it, like... Yeah, that's fine. Um... Just try and, like, curtsy or something. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> hang on. And what? Okay. Hello there. Bow down for me. Uh, very good. Yes. Yes. All right. <laughs> it's very nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah. um, nice so to meet you too. You, you a solo player? <laughs> yeah, I am. Okay, right. Well, uh, uh, I've given you permission. I hereby give you permission to live on my island. Thank you. Enjoy. So you live on the north of the Are island, you yes? I love on... island. Yes, me too, me yeah. too. There's like a cliff side. Uh -huh, like okay. a cliff side, like at the end of the river. And so that's where I settle down. Because I like to make tea. I'm going to uh, invite you so to the I team. Hell yeah. Like to... You like making I, tea? I, I... Oh my god, we're yeah. going to be so much friends. All the friends in the world. <laughs> okay. I'm, making a, I'm making a tea house. I'm making a tea cottage. Oh, you're doing that? Awesome. All right. Well, yeah. uh, it's very nice to meet you, and I'm gonna go do. We're gonna do a raid now. Uh, but good luck, and yeah. Good luck. Good luck. I mean, we can go do the raid if you want. Now that it's morning. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna do the raid. I'm just. I'm. I'm. Um. I'm just crafting now. So whose base is this across the water from yours? This stone. It's like three stone bases here. Yeah. Those are. Those are sort of like people. I'm. I've raided one of them, but I, I'm gonna raid the rest. Oh. <laughs> so they're not friendly. They're not your friends. No, they, they attack me. Oh, they attack you. Oh my yeah. god, okay. Oh, is this your base? Nice. <laughs> Some stuff for you right there. Well, from the loot we get from the rage, you can have it to finish your base. Let's go over here. Oh, there's a guy over here. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. No. Okay. Oh. Oh, no. Well, I raided this guy yesterday. That's what happened. And, um... <laughs> and, oh. and... <laughs> <laughs> and I actually have TC in this base. I'm sorry that my friend killed you, man. Look, I raided you yesterday. I, I, I raided <laughs> you yesterday, and and it and it happens, man. It's rust. You you did really well to put the door down, though. You managed to get a door down. That was pretty sick. While your friend was distracting me. All right, well, we'll take it easy, man. I feel bad for raiding him, but it's got to be done. All right, well, we're gonna raid his friend now. All right, Sod lovely. It. Let's do it. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 it's all, it's all going off in here. Tier two workbench, loads of boxes. Oh, uh, do you want to put that turret, like protecting that TC, like? Do you want to cover this, and I'll grab some grenades from base. Yeah. Take my yeah, hazzy, um, put that on, right. uh, and also take my Tommy. It's just Tommy's better. I'll be back. All right, let's do this. They've got some hidden hidden boxes up there. Oh. Yeah, look, 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 on that shelf, see? Oh, yeah, yeah, yep. Little sneaky sneakies. Hopefully the flame gets rid of the TC. That would be pretty, uh, pretty good. Oh. Okay. Furnaces are good. Wow. Holy crap. Do you want to come down here and have a look? Yeah, co come and have a look in this box here that's, that's thingy. It's got a, like, bunch of stuff Holy in. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. Dude. Now, I must admit, I was pretty relaxed here. I didn't think that anybody would come and try and counter raid. Purely because I'm on an island, it's a bit out of the way of everything else. Unless people are driving past on a boat or have a helicopter and happen to hear it right next to the island. Usually, it's pretty safe to raid on an island and not worry about counter raiders. So, I'm kind of relaxed here and I'm not taking this raid as seriously as I should be. And I pay the price right here. Oh, oh. we're being sad at. Oh, I'm wounded. Okay, I'm it's wounded. all good. It's all good. He's near the base where you were raiding. Where you raided. I think there's two, though. Or is it just one? Sounds like one. You no, could just two. hang in there with the Tommy. 
They gotta jump down. Outside. And one's on the top. There is, I think, three. Oh, he got me. Damn it. Sorry, I'm respawning. I'm respawning. Can you respawn straight away? Have you got a timer? I'm on a timer. They're building. They put a T. They put a TC down. Ah oh, no! Let's put a door down. Oh no! I've got to be quick. Oh no 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 no! Oh, he got me just in time. Oh, this is. Oh. Damn it! Oh no! We could have been. Ah, oh, could have been so much better prepared for this raid. Now I didn't want to do this, but Blizzard has been playing on this server for three days, the same amount of time that I've been playing on the server. And it's a known fact that Blizzard is an absolute chad at Rust. All it takes is three days and this guy has got rocket. He's got a base the size of the freaking White House. I didn't want to do this, but I've got to ask for backup here. These guys. Easy loot, man, easy loot. Oh, he's like 10 years old. I don't have any more gunpowder or anything. I might have to call upon my friend Blizzard here. <laughs> you might have to, mate. This is a... I'm going to add him to the call, actually. Yeah. Uh, yep. Blizzard. Blizzard, I need your help, man. I, I hate to call upon you like this. <laughs> it's desperate freaking times, dude. I've been seeing I've been seeing the kerfuffle in the in-game chat. Right. Look, <laughs> what's been happening? I need you to come over here with, with just some rockets or something. Just just please. Rockets? Yeah, This the, we got yeah. counter-raided and this, this mother fringy is just... He's inside. He's, he's upgraded the base and he's inside it. He can't okay. leave. Okay. How many rockets do I need? Uh, we're so we're so newbie, aren't we, El? El, how many uh, rockets does he need? Let me have a look. I'll tell you what kind of what what we'd need to get through. Yeah, yeah, that so, works. It's just two well, doors, no, two sheet metal doors, just, two sheet metal well, doors. What about this roof just here? Remember, this was like a hollow area. I think yeah. it's two sheet metal doors. Yeah, yeah. We, we need we need you here right now. Well, that's not <laughs> happening. Yeah. But I'll I'll try my best. Hey, Dom. Oh, over there's here. someone here. Where? There must be a lot of loot in there if he's doing this upgrading. All right, I just got back to base. What exactly is it yeah, that we, you want? We need, we need, one we need sheet to get, metal wall? One yeah, metal wall? I'll pay you back. I'll pay you back. I'll pay you back. <laughs> Dude, I, I'll pay you back, bro. I'm in your debt forever. I'll pay you back. <laughs> are you these, sure? It's one metal wall we have yeah, to go through. Yeah, 100%. 100%. Because the, these, okay. guys, these guys are shit talking and they're like, easy loot. And it's just like, we've got we've to gotta get in. All right. <laughs> I understand. So at this point in the wipe, Blizzard is without a doubt way ahead of me, all right? It's no secret that Blizzard absolutely is a chad at this game. He will grind it out more than me. So his base is unbelievably massive, and you'll get to see it at the end of the video. But he's got rockets, he's got helicopters, he's got everything now. We're only three days into the wipe, but that's just how Blizzard rolls in this game. So I managed to beg him to come over with some rockets, with his helicopter, and get inside this base. Remember, I'm the one that spent my satchels getting in this base. These guys that are inside now, they spent nothing. They do not deserve this loot. Blizzard to the rescue. But you guys have seen the inside, no? Yeah, we have, yeah. No, no, no! Whoa, 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 Hey, hey, Blizz, follow me. Like, come up the ladders on this oh, side. Okay. Yeah. So what they've... So basically how this base works is uh, mm -hmm. you go through here and then down and then the TC's on this back uh, triangle, right? How, how do you get to there? You have to go all the way around? No, no. You just go down and then, and then forward. And then uh -huh. it's got two doors, one here and one here. Oh, for God. different loot sections. Hey, you take uh, this wait, okay, here, take that. Oh, you said Armored, Python. man, armored. That's fine. Right. Oh, Just go, no. go, 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 right. go. Yeah, yeah. Go through the doors. You going through the doors? Yeah, yeah. I'll go, go through the doors. <laughs> uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's eight, it's eight. Oh my God, you see that? What a bunch of... That's fine, that's fine. They've griefed us, basically. We can't get in, I don't think. No, we can get in through the ceiling. What do you mean? Ceiling, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm here and explode this. Yeah, we'll do. Explode the rest of that. Okay, 7L. Mm-hmm. Oh, they oh, griefed that. They, they've griefed it. 
They briefed Where did you say TC was? Right through there. Okay, yeah, get in there. Wait, wait, yeah, let me rocket it. Let me rocket it. Yeah, rocket it. it. And then, because we need to destroy that. Yeah, because then hammer. we can we Who's can demolish. Hammer? Anyone got a hammer? hammer? No. I don't have any wood. They just threw a grenade for it. Oh, he did too. Did you see him? Oh, there's a sheet metal door there. Wait, wait, wait. Stop, 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 stop. What are you doing? Huh? I was destroying it. So we, we need to destroy this we, wall. We, we, yeah, destroy the TC there. though, but he's going to replace the TC. So do not destroy the TC yet. Wait until we have a hammer. We need a hammer. So somebody go grab a hammer. And we need oh, a TC because you need a TC to destroy it, right? You need TC access. Yes, yes. The a hammer and a TC is what we right. need. Well, well, I'm gonna have to go, go to base. Go to base. I will, I will, I will. Yeah. I don't think they actually griefed though because it's going through that sheet metal door. Yeah, so the the TC was in that little triangle and then... Yeah, yeah. Uh, we, we can see the new TC as well now. Oh, yeah, I see, I see. Bring some resources to seal the new TC as well so they can re-grief. I will, I will, I will. Okay, place it, place it. Nice. Nice. Let's jump out. What? I'm, oh, I can demolish this. Oh, nice. Oh, and there's a door there. Oh, I see. Yeah, I'm so trying can... to see if I can demolish the frame. I don't think so. Free the first door. Oh, he's right there. Oh my god, I'm dead. I killed him. I'm missing all my shots. Ugh. I'm respawning. I think he died. Yeah, there's a custom here. No, no, I killed both. I killed both. I didn't even realize. Right, oh my, the there's a lot of stone in there. Blizzard, you, the Blizzard, this loot is pretty much yours, mate. <laughs> this is all yours, uh, mate. <laughs> well, no, just take it and then pay me back instead. That's easier. Okay. You just pay me the rockets. I don't really care about anything else. Yeah, I'll pay you the rockets. How many rockets do I owe you? F I think five rockets. Five rockets and keep the expo ammo and then give me a stack of expo ammo. Are we through the I'm whole done. thing yet? Yeah, yeah. You can go down. Check. All right. All right. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. We <laughs> got the same day. Oh my god. Now, whilst we were focused on transferring the loot back to my base, two fully geared guys stole Blizzard's helicopter. But it turns out Blizzard actually saw the helicopter on the mainland, right next to the base that I went to earlier. Remember the base that I placed ladders on? Anyway, you're not going to believe what happens here. This is insane. Hmm. I'm going to make a new box for you just so you can easily store away stuff. Yeah. Right. Wait, can one of you give me some low grade fuel? What, there was some in that base, yes. right? Yes, I can do that. All right. I'll come quickly to the uh, base. Because I just see, I'm pretty sure they live in that base or they're checking it out or something or another. Or they're baiting, but my heli, I see my heli over there. Oh, really? Is it on mm -hmm. the island? No, it's uh, it's right at the next side. A near outpost? Yeah, yeah. I like where the M2 shots were just coming from. Yeah, pl place everything in there. We we've got to give Dom some loot for helping us out as well. Do you, want, do you want us to come and help you try and kill them or what? Uh, if you want to, yeah. I saw them running towards outposts, like running away from the heli. Maybe they ran out of low grade? Yeah, yeah. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Because it seems like they checked out the space. This decaying one here. Okay. If they were in there for that long. Unless they live there, like in the decaying base. That also seems a bit strange. Oh, wait, shit. I see them coming back for the heli. I'm swimming. Yeah, same, oh, same. No. Go to the right. Go to the right of the space. They might not see us. But they're they're running straight for this heli. Oh crap, I have 750 scrap on me. That's not good. Oh, they're for, oh, for sure gonna see oh, me. Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, yeah. Kill the driver, kill the driver. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're both dead, both dead. Let's go, M2. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's go, easy clap. Oh, up <laughs> on the roof, on the roof, on the roof of this base. Oh, yeah, yeah. Kill them, kill them. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, I'm gonna steal his hat. I need a hat. Uh, take the rest. Oh, Come, start looting. Start looting. We need to go. We need to go. They're in the space. Are you going uh. to my island? Oh, I'm dead. I'm deceased. It's right above you, Blitz. I killed both. I killed both. I'm coming out. Come over here. To you. Come here. Come here. I'm just getting out of here. I'm sorry. I'm okay. dipping. Yeah, yeah, do it, do it. Just run. He's at the roof now. You need to go. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm gone, I'm gone. Now, Blizzard quickly flew back to his base on the helicopter and deposited all the loot that he'd managed to get. One of the guys he killed had an M249. He came straight back on the heli to see if he could make more plays on these guys. Elle and I camped the base for a while, waiting for Blizzard to come back. Nice. This is the greedy issue. Screw it. Actually, there might be... I see the doors open. I might full greed. Yeah. You could have you picked Ooh. one of us up, man. Brought us up there. Nice. He's a chatty. Oh, they have good. unlootable loot rooms. Otherwise, it's all open. Oh. I have some furnaces. Okay. Nice. Wait. Say what we can get. They're bunker. Yes. Wait, I'm deep. No I'm way. Deep. How deep are we talking? I'm TC. I'm TC. What? <laughs> okay, there are bunkers here. I just need to make, make sure that they can't close this bunker. Oh, my God. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to base and grab some ladders. Don't leave me. Wait, no, no. Uh, okay. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Probably a good idea. Uh, does this count as payment for the rockets? Wait, where are I, You didn't do... What do you mean payment? <laughs> you're you're mean, grabbing yeah, stuff? Wait, get out of there. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, what? Now, I remember at the start of the video when I said that Blizzard and I had a competition to see who could build the bigger base this whole wipe. Well, let's fast forward a little bit because Blizzard is going to give El and I a base tour. I'm pretty sure you guys can probably guess who won this bet. Okay, this is Blizzard's base, the everyone. It's the it's ma majesty of the space cannot be understated. <laughs> right. Okay, continue uh -huh. with the tour. I'm not impressed. Yeah, yeah. You, you have to. You have to come up here. You have to come here. I mean, it's already like four times the size of yours, so. It's not you about. Kind it's, of it's, it's not all about the size. It's not all about the size. <laughs> it's about how you use it. I know. I know she told you that, but I mean, like, come on. I like it. Um, I like yours as well. So I'm mm. just gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna just keep looking through. You know. Then mm. again, I did get murdered in your area. So there's that. Um. <laughs> right. Right. Okay. Well, let's just keep going. All right. So here, this is what it's called an air lock. Oh. You see, this okay, is something right. Jordan's missing on his base. See here, when both of these doors open, you can go through and you can look outside on either side. Wow. This is what is known as an airlock. I fell off a little bit, so I'm just, I'm, I'm crawling back up. Just, uh, you know, <laughs> I know Jordan hasn't ever explained that. This is how that works. This is a, a what did you say, an airlock? Yeah, airlock. <laughs> wow, okay, wow. Uh, prime, you know, drop box location. Yep. Uh -huh. Okay, let me take you through the rest of the base. So here are, uh, you know, the bed and the lockers. And as we go here, we'll go closer to the tour. We'll go upstairs later. I'm already, I, like, I'm already feeling like this takes way too long. You know what I mean, guys? Oh like yeah, you see, well, protection requires time and doors are, and here are perfect loot rooms that are, you know, well-designed, don't have mismatching boxes, uh, I like are that. perfectly sorted. Okay, uh, before you go downstairs, I will have to empty the, the shotgun traps though. Now, to celebrate the end of our time on this server, Blizzard installed fireworks to his base um, to finish things off with a bank. But I do hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. It's the longest video I've ever posted, so I'd really appreciate it if you just let me know what you thought about it, really, in the comments, good or bad. Um, but if you have enjoyed it, feel free to drop the video a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'm just going to leave it at that, guys. I've had a blast. Um, shout out to Dominic, the guy I met from the other island. All the freaking alliances I've made. All the people in today's video, obviously. Go check out Blizzard's Twitch stream. I'll leave the links down below. Also, Elle has a Twitch as well. I'll leave her links down below as well. So, anyway... Thank you guys. I appreciate it. And I'll catch you very soon. Adios.